Hi everyone, this is Max again. So yesterday I had my latest appointment with my orthodontist and uh, it's been about almost a year and a half. It's like year and five months, I guess so far, that uh, um, since I got my braces. And quite honestly, it is going way faster and um, way better than I expected. Um, anyways, I'm gonna let you see what happened during that appointment and you'll be the judge of it. Hi, how are you doing? Doing good. You're doing good? Yeah. I, I know, do, uh, I like the, the filter you used on your teeth the other day. Oh. Yeah. Like the bright white. Yeah, That's smile. Cool. Yeah. Smile for me? You look really good. Alright, cool. How's rubber bands going? Fine. They're fine? Yeah. Okay, cool. So today, um, we're gonna still work on details. Okay, so I'm gonna make a couple bends to the wire just to kind of get everything to settle in. So we can try to get you finished up by November. That's what was their plan, December? Well, Definitely had, before the end Christmas. of the year. Okay, before Christmas. Okay. So, okay. All right, let's take a peek. Santa Claus is coming to town. <laughs> Bringing you uh, a braces free smile, right? Yeah. All right, how's the family? Good. Everybody's good? Yeah, kid is yeah. at the grandparents this morning. What great, are, what's, are they going to school this year or who's going to school? Uh, so Emma is going to her second year of pre-K and okay. next year she's going to school. And we will yeah. go to. And we will go to pre-K next year. Okay. All right. Well, yeah, I mean, they're still pretty young, so. All right. Ooh, look at your teeth. Ooh, this looks good. Okay. All right. So let me see here. Over jet. I may need a disc. Okay. Bite together. Bite together. There you go. Good. Okay. Yeah, Mindy, don't open it yet because I'm... I think I'm just gonna continue this step down. We're gonna continue that anterior elastic. Um, Mindy, can you also grab me um, some articulating paper? Yes, there's some on the train. Okay, great, okay. Yes. Let's see, honey, what I wanted today. All right, so I th we had done this before. This is uh, articulating paper. It basically is like a carbon paper, like the old receipt paper. Um, and it's gonna mark your bite. So where the canine is here, that's different height than this tooth here. It's a bigger tooth. So ultimately, this tooth I may be colliding in here, keeping the bite open a little bit. So, and you might feel that when you bite, like it's kind of rubbing here. Do you notice that at all? Uh -uh. No. Okay. So I'm just gonna well, check. Like, if I do it fast, yes, yeah. it kind of. Okay. So yeah, we'll do a high speed and then um, a football car bite. Okay. okay. So I'm gonna have you tap, 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 bite together, tap, tap. Keep, and then grind, 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 grind. Good, open for me again. Same thing, tap, tap, tap. And grind, grind real good. Good, I'm gonna pull it, perfect. Go ahead, bite, together. Grind, good. Tap, 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 grind. Good, perfect. Okay, so what this is gonna do then, open for me again, okay. You see how it kind of marks like where you're hitting? And I figured that was like gonna be like the edge. You're hitting a little bit high here. You're hitting high here. That's good though. You wanna have contact all the way around. Not super heavy down here, but I, I don't like that little corner. And again, you're hitting a little bit high on this camera. So we're gonna do a little adjustment. I'm gonna recheck your bite, okay? All right, cool. So this is called occlusal equilibration. And it's just me making some little bite changes. And for most adult patients, we have to do this just to make sure you have your bite feels good at the end um, for everything. And then remind me, who is doing your, are you having implants done? No, you were gonna refer me to something, oh, okay. remember? Yeah, so I will do that today. Okay. <laughs> so we're gonna also get, if you could grab for him, um, Dr. Sonata's yep. card. Okay, so open for me again, dear. All right, so we're just gonna do a little polish on the back side. Because again, this tooth is thicker than the tooth that is supposed to be there. So again, not unusual that we have to do this. You doing okay? Yeah. Okay. Same thing down here. This is catching this little edge. So again, this paper just highlights where you're kind of con contacting a little bit heavier. Back at this lateral chin up for me a little bit more, dear. There you go. Oh, sorry, I know. <laughs> Upside down and backwards. Okay, go ahead, bite together. 
Does it feel different at all? Maybe it feel a tiny, a tiny little, bit. Yeah, a little bit different. Might not be too much. No, but okay, good. Yeah, different. Okay. Okay, and then even after the braces come off, we do a little bit more of this too, just to kind of mm -hmm. fine tune that bite. All right, so let's check with the paper again. Tap, 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 and grind. Let go ahead, bite, and grind. Good, that's better there. Go ahead, bite together. Hold and grind. There you go. Perfect. Bite together again. Good. Up again. Perfect. Thank you so much. All right. Okay, fantastic. Okay. All right, I'm going to do a little bit of pot. I'm sorry, I'm going to block this for a second just so I can see my light. A little adjusting of these edges. So where we're going to be sending you is to a prosthodontist. So a prosthodontist uh, specializes in the aesthetics and cosmetics. Like I'm an orthodontist specialized in straightening the teeth. A prosthodontist has gone to school beyond dentistry and has specializing on implants, crowns, all that aesthetic stuff, okay? And that's going to get you the best aesthetic result. Because even though a dentist knows how to, or can, or is able to do anything, we need somebody with a little extra skill. Because you're extra special. <laughs> Mama says I'm special. <laughs> uh, four weeks for her, yeah. If we can do four to five weeks. I know in five weeks I'm back down here. Four weeks is like back to school, and I, I am speaking at a conference in Austin, so I might not be here. So again, Five weeks, I know for sure I'm in this office. Okay. Yeah. I just want to plan to do that. I know. So why don't we do that? It's like the second or third week of September would probably be good. So why don't we say five weeks? If you have any trouble, you let me know right away, okay? We can get in. But if the swelling gets worse, you let me know. Okay? You look so good. Okay? Hang in there, girl. How was the wedding, by the way? Was it good? Yeah. Even just from like last week, swelling went down. Yeah. You got this, girlfriend. All right, bye, you guys. Have a good one. Thanks for trucking all the way down here. See if you can get ice cream next door. Okay. <laughs> okay, go ahead, bite together for me, dear. Okay, cool. All right, so again, I'm going to make probably one final adjustment, to be honest. I think what we I want to do to get you finished is everything does look so good. Keep on going with that anterior elastic. Can you tell me um, the elastic where he has here? So upper two box elastics with the Elliot's. Mm -hmm. And then you're going the side rubber bands. You're doing the side rubber bands? So, yes, I do Fred, Yeah. Dwight, and Fred, not the Elliot's. Oh, the Elliot's is he's, a he's not messing around. He likes it. Like, yeah. <laughs> this is why it's looking so good, right? Because we're really pulling that together. Go ahead, bite together again, dear. Okay. Yeah, just gotta get it to come down just a smidgen more. Okay, yeah, you look really good. Okay, so I'm gonna make a couple of wire adjustments today and pop that in, okay? All right, cool. So, so um, Roberto. <laughs> no, Roberto, no, he's gonna blow his teeth out of his head if he does that. Go ahead, bite together. <laughs> How do you know about Roberto? <laughs> All right, so let me see if I can get a little step down here. This is actually looking really good. I really, I just want these two middle ones to come down a little bit more. That lateral looks good. What I may do, what are your thoughts on finishing you with the braces and maybe just doing a couple of tweaking final aligners? Like, in, like you're gonna wear a retainer anyway. Yeah. Would you be open to that? Absolutely. Okay, cool. Then that's honestly, I think what my plan will be. Okay, cool. And honestly, aligners sometimes are just easier to get this bite to come together at the end. Whatever. Okay. You're like, just get the to be. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Actually, I, I had like a customer that. the other day. She uh, is also one of your clients. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Oh, gosh. Hopefully, she didn't have anything bad to say. <laughs> no. I mean, she, she's very excited. She, she's doing the Invisalign, though. Oh, cool. Yeah. I mean, you're going to be wearing a retainer anyway. Yeah. So. No, I, I talked to my wife this morning about, like, you know yeah. how people. Ooh, 
Oh, sorry. And it drops a spring. Um, how people <laughs> this is why get braces and never wear, um, never wear the aligners and then right. teeth go sideways right. a couple years later. I was right, like, right, exactly. Now I'm going to swear it every... Well, yeah. you said it's first three months, it's 24-7, and then after yeah. that, it's at night. Usually, I mean, for kids, I always say full-time for three months and then nighttime for adults, I'm a little bit more lenient. Like I usually say, as long as you wear it like 12 hours a day. I was gonna say, I mean, yeah. I don't do anything with my teeth at night, so I might as yeah. well wear it. So. Yeah, so now some of this cosmetic work that you need to have to get finished. So before we even get into that, so I definitely want you to reach out to the prosthodontist. I'm giving you his information today. Mm -hmm. Try to see him before I see you next time, okay? Because I might not even have to do, I, I may do the finishing aligners, but I might not because this might be exactly where he wants things to be okay. to do his thing. So I don't want to like over treat if we don't need to, right? If he's okay. ultimately going to fix um, this. Do you need to open point or make sure this isn't going to shift. Perfect. Okay, that works. All right, so go ahead and re PC the bottom. Uh -huh. All of these little marks that are on the teeth, I mean, we'll just get a cotton roll. We can just wipe them off. So yeah. if you see anything after you leave here, you just it will brush right off, okay? Mm -hmm. um, and then I'm gonna get you, I'll talk with you about the referral. Now, uh, Dr. Sonata, he has an office here in Columbia, and then he has another office in Towson. Really to get any like good work, like you're gonna have to go at least to Towson. But I mean, I know you follow him all over the place here. So um, he's down here in Columbia on Mondays and he's literally right around the corner. Um, but again, you can Mondays coordinate. Mondays is when I work, so it needs okay. to be Tuesday. Oh, okay. Yeah, so then it will probably be up in Towson then, okay, at his office. So I'm gonna write the referral over what to evaluate for. I just want you to reach out to him to schedule a consultation. As long as he can fit me in. Yeah. So, yeah, and so it will be him or Dr. Aquino, they both work together. Um, and then I'd say, let me see you. So again, I'm back down here in five weeks if you wanna to try to do five weeks, or six to eight if you wanna pop up in one of the other offices. I get back to Abingdon again in September. So you can always ask when I'm back in Abingdon. So five weeks will be September. I know. Mm -hmm. So in five weeks, I'm gonna be here. So it might be six weeks that I'm in Abingdon. Just check to see. Okay. Yeah, which is Well, fine. let's do this. Since you want me to see him first, let's yeah. see what he says. Yeah. I'll, I guess I'll communicate with you about my appointment with him. Oh, so yeah, we can we can just coordinate the visit with you. Yeah. Put something on the book, though. So it doesn't, yeah, no matter what, like even if I, yeah. even if you can't see him, mm -hmm. Definitely see me in six weeks, no matter what. So try to see him. Should I see you in Abingdon or here? You can see me wherever. Okay. Wherever. I mean, it doesn't make a difference. Yeah. Let me just see when I'm in Abingdon.